Hi friends, let's talk about stress management of it today. These are difficult times. Everybody is struggling and juggling with multiple things, especially when we all had to be at home. Managing our house, our children, our office, our families, and most importantly, precious us. Precious, yes. And in fact, very precious. Because if we don't know how to handle ourselves, how to manage ourselves, then it will be really impossible for us to be rightly aware and do multitasking correctly. So what really is stress? Everybody is dealing with it these days. In fact, some people think that it is a new normal. They think that it is an added limb to their body which they need to take care of. Some feel that it is an appendage that they cannot get rid of. But let me tell you, stress is not part of you. Let me tell you again, stress is not part of you. You get stressful because you don't know how to handle your mind and your brain. Stress management is nothing but knowing how to handle your precious things. For example, your house, your business, your property, your children, your family and of course yourselves. Once you know how to manage these precious things, then you can learn how to correctly manage your stress. So what's happening is you don't pay attention on how to handle your mind, how to handle an emotion how to handle this body and how to handle the energies within and around you. Nothing has been done about it. You are trying to manage such a sophisticated system accidentally, just by fluke. So you being stressful is the natural outcome of this unaware living. Now let's suppose you are a student. So being a student is stressful. If you don't get a job after college, it is stressful. If you get a job, it is more stressful. If you don't get married, that is stressful. If you get married, then <laughs> let me not even talk about it, what people say after being a couple of years together. If you don't have children, that is stressful. If you have children, then you pull your hair out with stress. So, it is not your job or your other family responsibilities which make you stressful. Stress is happening to you because of your inability to know and manage your own system. So, what we need to do is to make our system go on an easier pace. Once we learn that, we can be more efficient and less stressful. For example, if we are driving a car at 2000 rpm, the engine may last for 100,000 kilometers. But if we are driving the same engine with 5000 rpm, the engine may last only for 50,000 kilometers or less because it is unnecessarily revved up. We complain that we don't have enough energy these days like we had before and we are slowing down. That's natural because we have used up that energy faster earlier and it is okay to slow down and be efficient. It's okay to ease up a bit to gain efficiency. It is high time you've done some inner engineering to know more about yourself and learn the techniques of adequate pacing and easy efficiency in your life. Hope it has helped. To know more, please reach out on the given number or email address or otherwise you can visit us on www.tishadeepan.com. Thank you.